Here are some sobering facts to consider. The American Medical Association says that employees who show up at work but are not fully productive cost companies over $150 billion a year. A 2018 Gallup survey shows that only 15% of workers say they are truly engaged at work. If that's how people evaluate their willingness to put forward their full energy, leaders have to consider what they can do to get their best work from their employees. Hi, I'm Dave Edwards, and today we look at how to assess whether your employees are truly engaged in their work and what you can do to improve the situation. Before we get started, I want to remind you that my weekly newsletter is available with a simple click of the mouse. Go to my webpage and click on Contact Me. That's DaveEdwardsMedia.com. Click on Contact Me, fill out the form, and my weekly digest of productivity, leadership, and management will show up in your email uh, about once a week. Okay, let's look at what you can do if your workers just seem to be going through the motions. First of all, it starts with you as the leader. Leaders need to be engaged. Being a good role model is key as workers want to see their boss working just as productively as they are expected to be. Your enthusiasm will go a long way. And oh, by the way, don't forget to smile. Share details. If you want to see your workers get excited about their work, make sure they understand why their contributions are important to the bigger picture. Talk to people. Sometimes you hear managers say that they have an open door policy. If you want engaged workers, don't make them come to you. Take an interest in them and their work. Show your appreciation. Notice the little things that people do. Praise them. Let them know you appreciate them and what they accomplish. Give them growth opportunities. People will give you greater effort if you're willing to provide them with educational opportunities and training that allows them to grow professionally. New knowledge is a great motivator. And support their decisions. When faced with new or difficult situations, let your workers try new solutions. Very few problems have just one solution. Your support and trust will be a tremendous motivating source. When your workers wake up in the morning and know what is expected of them and why it's important and their efforts are appreciated, they will no longer be part of that Gallup poll statistic. And you will have proven again why you are a true leader. Now, what happens if you have someone that you work with or worse yet, someone you supervise who is not only unengaged, but because of his or her behavior is causing problems for everyone else. Maybe morale is suffering as a result. It's actually a pretty common scenario. And that's why I created an online course, How to Manage Difficult People. You'll gain an understanding of what motivates these kind of workers and how you should respond to their behavior or attitudes. Check out How to Manage Difficult People. Visit my website, daveedwardsmedia.com, and click on Courses. I'm Dave Edwards. Thanks for joining me today.